1976 Winnebago Chieftain Turbo LS. Gentlemen, is it closed? Thank you. So before I get started, what do I need to know before I do anything here? Well, the shifter doesn't line up, right? Yeah, the shifter works perfect. It's just that whatever you're showing, like like park is park, but the rest don't line up because yeah. the GM throws different from a Dodge. So, feel, feel the notch. You can feel a shift. Yeah. Just don't pay attention to what it says. You, you can feel it in each gear. Second is drive. So that, that's reverse. There's neutral. That's, that's, oh, that's reverse. That's okay. reverse. That's yep. reverse. Yep. That's neutral. That's overdrive, and then that's third. The next one down. The next one's third? But yeah, just leave, you, it, you just leave it in drive. Just yeah. leave it in drive. Yeah. yeah. Okay. What do I need to know with the throttle response, steering, braking? It's, it's a short throttle. Like, it's pretty touchy. Yeah, okay. We shorten the pedals so it has less throw. Okay. It's but it, it, it's, it's not weird. And the brakes are... Brakes are fine. Yes. They work a lot of force. They work. Yeah. There's nothing wrong with the brakes, it's just it's a 70s yeah, it's just... thing. Okay. And the steering's terrible. Yeah. So the steering is just very, very vague. It's gonna be that food truck, but like older and shittier, basically. <laughs> in, in every way. Okay. So just have that Throttle response is. Kind of short. Like, yeah, the, the throttle's not that it's weird. It's so heavy that it doesn't matter. Probably in a car, I mean, it'd, it'd be uh, weird. Okay. Does the horn work? Uh, maybe? No. No? The, like, Can I the, try it? Yeah, the wiring's just like... Oh, no, it doesn't work. The wiring's there, I just never put the horn back, I guess. Did you get it back to me? I just never... So I am over the front wheels? Uh, yeah. So well, you're right on top. You're right on top. Okay. So just take it wide and cut in. Yeah, well, pay attention to the ass swings, because you have like six foot well, hanging over the rear wheels. That. Only a gas station. Yeah. I worry about clipping the pump when I pull out. Okay. That, you don't have to worry about anything on the front, because the bumper is literally here. Yeah. Uh -huh. All the way at the back. Around. <laughs> where uh, where are my wipers? Uh, they're they're like only high speed and they're like right here. Okay. So, that so was just like bypass because the switch went. Okay, I've got curtains here that kind of block my view. I've got some mirrors that are doing something. I've got Nissan Maxima. All right, coming out. Cutting now. Oh, you're good. Cutting now. Oh, I, yeah, there's the yeah, slosh. That's what you're going to get, yep. Then you're good. The faster you go, the better. The faster I go, the less slosh there is? Well, yeah, on the highways, it, it gets pretty it's, stable. It's pretty stable. Okay. Within reason, I mean, if roads are crappy, then I slow down, like back roads like this. I don't like chain fly up because it does get a little washy, but... Okay, brakes on. No one coming, no one coming, here I go. Oh wow, it, yeah, it is touchy. Yeah. And I get on it. <laughs> it's like a normal car, yeah, yeah. acceleration. But wow, there's a lot of motion in the ocean here. Yep. This does not, none of this makes, oh, that is, a, that is, that sounds perfect. Oh, there's the kick down. Yep. Yep. <laughs> and I hear it. It's all right here. Well, the reason it gets loud is the, it, it's an open wastegate in the crossover. Yeah. So when the waste gate opens, it's open header, basically. Uh -huh. That's why something is loud. Ah. Do I have like engine management stuff in this head unit or is it just uh, audio? It's audio. Not okay. Not audio. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's, it's stock ECM, so there's no fancy like thing or anything. All right, like there's that. where some of the shake comes into the wheel. Yeah. Yep. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Just ride it out. It's Just hard. ride it out? Yeah. All right. Yeah, this is a very, very firm accelerator pedal. Yeah, but it actually had three springs. We cut two of them and it's still that firm. Yeah. Because we shortened that you less of a lever on it. Oh my goodness. This is 
an amazing creation. Anybody tell you you're a genius, Corey? Whoa, whoa something just snapped. Alright, that's just off the lamp. Oh, okay. This, this is going deep into my memory as an amazing day. That's what I was saying, it feels like a stock Chevy pickup. Yeah. Like it's fine, it's not slow. Yeah, it keeps up the traffic, no problem. Oh, just hearing that all the time, but whoa. Well, you see, the thing is, you get so much power, you think you're in a normal car for a second, and then you just, whoa, boy. Well, I'm always like braking too late. <laughs> I just threw my turbo at that, I think, at that uh, old muscle car there. Yeah, you can feel the he turn. was looking at us. The turns are the worst thing, like, like bends like this. You feel yeah. Of, like, feels like you're, I mean, you get used to it, you know. So that's Ford. pretty cool. Ford. Yeah. That's my style. I think I know that guy. Is that a Galaxy? Yeah, it, looks yeah, it was like a Galaxy or a Fairlane, one or the other. <laughs> Those tires are noisy. Yep. You should feel the drive shaft out here. It feels pretty, pretty crazy. <laughs> For real? Yeah, I, was, I mean, I knew it was a little noisy, but. Yeah, I told you that it made. Well, that's probably the rear. Something. Making the noise. You feel it my foot. You don't feel it up there, so don't worry about it. Nice, bad, just in my mouth. I remember being at the supermarket and running into that Ford like that and they and I was in my Falcon and they knew who I was so I, I wonder if they were wondering if this was an RCR shoot happening you know this is such the craziest thing you hear the turbo flutter coming from a Winnebago it's also why do I have a rear view mirror right here flutter all the time at people. Have you calculated the mileage? I think it's like seven and a quarter. Ah. Yeah. Ah. But that's better like, than the old one. But that's that's cruising like over 70 the whole way to South Carolina and back. Like, you know what I mean? Like we passed like a lot of other RVs. You know? Well because the old setup didn't have overdrive, this thing went like 55 miles an hour. Ah. Out. through the brake pedal.
pressing hard. Yeah, have that thing. Right. These are actually like new front the brakes. You might overshot. You're not gonna find. Uh, yeah, just put back up. Yeah. It? Nope. Nope. Back up. Where's my hazards? Sorry about that. Oh. We're pretty much off the road anyway, it didn't matter. Alright, I am not going to cut in front of this guy. It's a little washy pole in here. How should I handle this uh, bumpy road coming in? Just watch the sticks because it's too short. Oh, yeah, the they're, they're short. The trees. So you say watch the sticks? Yeah, the trees are too low. You have to go over on the left. Yeah. Okay. Good. May I goose it up the hill? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Break, break. Whoa, break. The one two shift's good now. <laughs> wow. This is an unbelievable, raucous machine. Thank you for building it, Corey. No problem. <laughs> oh. I, had most, I had the engine trans, so I was like... I am sweating up here. Really? <laughs> this is an unbelievable experience. <laughs> LSs make everything better. <laughs> What's cool is like, you're not worried about... It sucks, it sucks to put a motor in this and it'll go, but it's, they're so cheap, so it's like, you can't be upset about it, you know? The motors are just cheap, and they work, you know? This is like unknown mileage for the motor. Mm-hmm. But if I knew it had the Gen 4 rods, like the better rods, so... Okay. Shut off procedure. All the way to park. Park actually works, and then just key off. And just... Yeah, it's all just like a normal car. Yeah. Thank you, Corey. No problem. Thanks so much. Yep, thanks. Oh, that was a trip. I was, I was saying to Roman, you, you should got a POV, POV from the bathroom. Because <laughs> the toilet faces forward. <laughs>